Hi guys, uh, here I've got the Samsung Galaxy S2. Uh, this, was, uh, this was released in uh, May or June of last year, so this is about a year old. We've got the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. This came out in November of last year. And then here we've got the Samsung Galaxy S3. Um, and this came out, uh, this came out really recently. Um, this came out simply just last month. So these are all using Quadrant Standard 2, version 2. And I'm just going to set all the benchmarks going at the same time and uh, we're going to see and compare the scores and uh, basically how well the different, um, the different phones perform. So just to give you some background information, the Samsung Galaxy S2 here contains a, a Samsung processor. It's dual core 1.2 gigahertz. Um, the Galaxy Nexus here contains a Texas Instruments processor. It's dual core 1.2 uh, gigahertz as well. And then the Samsung Galaxy S3 has a quad-core 1.4 gigahertz processor. Um, and as you can see, actually, the S3 is speeding well ahead, um, going very quickly, uh, way ahead of the uh, other two phones. Um, so we'll compare and we'll see what the scores are uh, when the benchmarks are finished. Um, so there we go, the S3 is already finished. And we see the S3 has a score of 5,360. Next up is the S2, which scores 4,052. And the Galaxy Nexus is still going. Um, but we'll see how that does uh, when, it, when it completes. Um, just a few more tests to go. And, um, which is pretty impressive. I mean, the Galaxy S3 has a high resolution screen and um, still scores really highly. So here we go, so this is uh, Samsung Galaxy S3, 5360 is in top place. Next up is the Samsung Galaxy S2, scoring 4052. And finally, the Samsung Galaxy Nexus, uh, scoring 2049. So the fastest phone of the three is the latest, uh, which is probably no surprise, um, but the Samsung Galaxy S3 is the best performing of all the free phones.